the art world was recently rocked by a fascinating controversy. Flamingone, a striking photograph of a flamingo mid-flight, won a prestigious photography competition. It was a beautiful image, capturing the elegance and grace of the bird. The photographer basked in the glory, accepting accolades for their exceptional work. However, the celebration was short-lived. It was soon revealed that the photographer had used an AI image generator. Flamingone was not a product of human skill and artistry, but rather of algorithms and data sets. The competition organizers were shocked, and the award was swiftly revoked. The photographer's admission sent shockwaves through the art community. The Flamingone incident sparked heated debate about the nature of art, photography, and the increasing influence of artificial intelligence. It raised questions about originality, authenticity, and the very definition of a photograph. The lines between reality and artificiality were suddenly blurred. This was not just about a single photograph or a competition. It was a symbolic event, highlighting the growing tension between traditional art forms and the rapidly evolving capabilities of AI. The Flamingone incident forced the world to confront a new reality, one where machines could create art that was indistinguishable from human creations. The rise of AI image generators like DAL E2 and Mid Journey has ushered in a new era in photography. These sophisticated programs can generate hyper-realistic images from simple text prompts, blurring the line between reality and digital fabrication. The technology is evolving at an astonishing pace, making it increasingly difficult to distinguish AI-generated images from real photographs. This has profound implications for the field of photography. The ability to create stunning images with just a few keystrokes challenges the traditional notions of skill, effort, and artistic vision. Photographers, once reliant on their technical expertise and creative eye, now find themselves competing with algorithms capable of producing equally impressive, if not better, results. This paradigm shift is not just about the tools of creation, but also about the consumption and interpretation of photography. When AI can generate images that are indistinguishable from reality, how do we assess the authenticity and value of a photograph? Do we need to rethink the criteria by which we judge photographic art? These questions are at the heart of the ongoing debate. The Flamingone incident serves as a stark reminder that we are entering uncharted territory. The rules and conventions that have governed photography for decades are being challenged. As AI continues to evolve, the relationship between photographer, camera, and subject will continue to be redefined. The disqualification of Flamingone sparked outrage and debate within the artistic community. Many photographers felt deeply unsettled, arguing that AI-generated images undermined the very essence of photography. For them, photography was about capturing moments in time, about the photographer's unique perspective and skill in framing and capturing light. AI, they argued, threatened to devalue their craft. Traditional artists also voiced concerns. They saw AI as a threat to human creativity and originality. They argued that art was an expression of the human experience, of emotions, thoughts, and perspectives that could not be replicated by algorithms. AI-generated art, they feared, lacked the soul and depth of human creation. However, not everyone was opposed to AI's foray into the art world. Some artists embraced the new technology, seeing it as a powerful tool for creative expression. They argued that AI could help artists to overcome creative blocks, to explore new ideas and concepts, and to push the boundaries of art. They saw AI as a collaborator, not a competitor. The Flamingone incident highlighted the deep divisions within the art world. It forced artists, critics, and the public alike to confront the ethical and philosophical implications of AI and art. It sparked a conversation about the nature of art, the role of technology, and the future of creativity itself. The Flamingone incident shines a light on a crucial aspect of the AI art debate, the blurring of lines between reality and artificiality. As AI image generators become more sophisticated, it becomes increasingly difficult to distinguish between a photograph captured through a lens and an image conjured by algorithms. This ambiguity challenges our understanding of truth, authenticity, and the very act of creation. In the past, we relied on photography to provide a window into reality, to document events, and to capture fleeting moments in time. But what happens when AI can fabricate these moments with stunning realism? How do we determine the veracity of an image when the line between documentation and fabrication becomes increasingly blurred? These are not just philosophical questions, but practical concerns with real-world implications. The ability of AI to mimic and manipulate reality raises profound ethical questions. What happens when AI-generated images are used to spread misinformation or to manipulate public opinion? How do we ensure that this powerful technology is used responsibly and ethically? These are questions that we, 
as a society, need to grapple with urgently. The Flamingon incident serves as a wake-up call, urging us to develop a critical eye and a discerning mind when it comes to AI-generated content. We need to be aware of the potential for deception and manipulation, and we need to develop frameworks and guidelines for the ethical use of this transformative technology.